do this is another video with me flex gaming in this vlog we will be doing well we will be unboxing well not unboxing but using uh, the gun that i finally got working the nerf vortex nitro hope you all see this A battle rattle, but uh, not to worry. Fully automatic, shoots every 1.6 seconds. Pretty good. Safety on, safety off. Mag loose. I'll stick the mag in now. In this video, we will be testing this out and looking at some of my other ones if you want. My first, well, I think this is my first video really. Uh, but yeah. Oh no, it's not really welcome to another video, is it? It's welcome to a video. But still, as you can see, bag release. There we go, safety off. Quite loud. If you're doing a uh, Therefore, you wouldn't really want this because it'd hear you. But it's good. So, I'm it's a bit of a shoot with it. Just go. It's nice, isn't it? But yeah. Safety on. Gotta pick up my boots. But as you can see, I like this gun quite a bit. This is the uh, first video. I hope you'll be liking and subscribing soon enough. Leave a comment if you want. But yeah. Leave a comment, subscribe, and like. Bye, my last one. Wait, I'm gonna need the shoot. Shot fire. Yeah, let's uh, start with another gun. This isn't Nerf, but uh, it's extreme, I think. Disc shooter. Got the same disc. It's not water disc, necessarily. The chokes, yeah. But I think we've just shoot the broken on this. We don't have to shoot the foam discs without the plastic. Double valve, 12 bullets, 6 in each drum. Out of ammo. Switch to the other gun. It's pretty nice. Then uh, this is actually quite an old nerf gun. It's a uh, end strike, not even elite. No, it looks elite with the orange and blue, but you can tell it's not with the yellow. But, It's a bit underpowered, but a detachable barrel, useful for storing it, mag release, simple mag, I think this is, yeah, this is an elite mag, still works with the uh, thing, this has got a bit more battle rattle than the Vortex, but yeah, it's good. If you want to make it more powerful, I will show you how. But um, I haven't made this one more powerful because I need a new spring for that one. But with one like the um, Maverick, the end strike, you take it apart, and on the back there's a spring. So the barrel's over here, and the lock, stock, and reload thing over here. The spring's there. You put there's a bit of you put uh, you can have put a, a two two cent coin. Or if you're aiming to like a one p coin, or you can uh, put a bit of a cork behind it, so the spring is shorter, so it has more power. And that makes it more powerful if it's underpowered. Not sure how to do it with that one yet. I haven't taken that one apart properly. You need to take the stock. You need to take take the stock off to 
this one and this one. They're like, look pretty cool without the stock as well. But helps with it helps with your aiming because if you like if you don't have that, then it's just all over the place. But I like one of those. I will be back with you in one minute. Slightly less than a minute, doesn't that? But still, Maverick, uh, spring and the rock stock and reload thing broke, so I've got an elastic band to put it back. This has got the extra bit of kit in it. This is like one of my favourite ones. Broke it when I went to run swing it around. There's a telephone pylon. Hit that and if it broke, still worked. All right though. Uh, pretty sure you all know this one. We've got another bullet for this under. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's the Magnus. Got Frank called Magnus. Let's see what you watch this video right now. So. Go watch your magnets. Peace out. Yeah. Bollocks. Yeah, the screw broke in this bit, so it doesn't really hold together that well anymore. Oh, bollocks. Gum jump. I'm going to do this, but first time for everything. The last bullet is the best one after this. Whistler darts. Empty. Three, uh, three bullet capacity, or three dark capacity. Um, where's that other one gone? Okay, it's over there. I can also make it whistle by throwing it. But I'd have to throw these bullets harder than I can shoot them, so. Yeah. Pretty nice. I'll have to show you another thing. It's my favourite game at the moment Xbox 360. If you can all see this Borderlands 2. It's pretty nice. Characters at the back. Salvador, who. He's actually like the same height as me. Zero, who's about seven feet tall. Uh, Maya, who's around average height, and Axton, who is average height. He's the gunzerker. His special ability: gunzerking. Dual wield any two weapons: two rocket launchers, two miniguns. Uh, his special ability is the uh, what was it again? Something turret, but he can put us turret down. You have to make it in your skill tree so you're able to have more than one. You're able to make it so it's able to launch rocket launchers, like able to launch rockets. You're able to make it so you can hang it on the roof or the wall. Uh, yeah, so it's pretty good. Um, Maya, her special ability is uh, phase lock. So you're able to like sh um, swoop someone into the air and they're not able to do anything. And if you shoot them while in the air, it does more, like the next damage that you do in the next magazine uh, puts more damage onto the next person you kill. And uh, with Zero, who is the assassin. So assassin, assassin, siren, gunzerker, and commando. But the assassin, his special ability, well, evasion. You're able to go invisible. Well, you're able to go invisible and have a clone that starts swinging his sword around, while you can go somewhere else. It's pretty, pretty neat. Then there's. Handsome Jack. And the classic, Psycho. There's a few new mobs. Like, they're. There's like super badass loaders. There's, you know, bully mongs. Uh, there's a uh, Salvador Gunzerking, killing bully mongs. And then there's nomads. And there's 
Yeah, there's loads of stuff here. Some new things, and there's uh, constructors that build EXP loaders that basically explode when they get near to you. Then you disable your shield, that you have to get shields that do spike damage and stuff. It's pretty cool. Then I got some more games, like Forza Horizon, Star Wars Battlefront 2, Lord of the Rings War in the North, Aliens, Colonial Marines, Two Human, uh, Ninja Gaiden 3, Dead Island, Dead Island Riptide, Forza Motorsport 3, uh, Need for the Opposite, it's uh, about all my good games. Oh, apart from something that I've recently got quite bored of. I think you can guess which game that is. Minecraft. And, uh, I don't know. I think that's it. So I'll go for the Lost Odyssey, which I recently got for my birthday. Right, recently, in March. What else did I have? I had Assassin's Creed 1, which I gave away. Uh, what else did I have? Can't remember now, but... Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, and smash, the, smash that subscribe. Bye. Flex out.